an armored brigade is engaging multiple threats with different levels of anti-tank measures. In the heat of battle, the M1 Abrams crews must think fast and decide which type of round is optimal for each objective. From heat and multi-purpose anti-tank rounds to can rounds, the tankers have to target enemy armor, bunker defenses, or enemy infantry one at a time before changing the type of round. In combat, this is perilous and consumes life-saving time, which has led the army to introduce a 4-in-1 tank round that aims to make tactical decisions easier on the battlefield. The XM-1147 is a round not to be taken lightly, as it can quickly transition from destroying anti-tank guided missile targets beyond 2,000 meters to tearing apart thick bunker walls or decimating enemy combatants at close range. Advanced Weapons Northrop Grumman Corporation is an American global aerospace and defense technology company. It is one of the largest defense contractors in the world, specializing in various sectors of the aerospace and defense industry. Grumman has a long history of cooperation with the United States military and has provided the armed forces with state-of-the-art technology during the latest armed conflicts, especially the War on Terror at the dawn of the 21st century. The multinational defense company has over 95,000 employees and annual revenue exceeding $30 billion. Currently, Grumman has grabbed the attention of media outlets with the announcement of the B-21 Raider, the successor to the powerful and stylish B-2 stealth strategic bomber. Nevertheless, that has not stopped Northrop Grumman from keeping its focus on land-based systems, especially those that can support infantry in armored vehicles. During the last 15 years, Grumman has been working on a new multi-purpose tank round that many military experts claim will change the nature of armored warfare. Vanguard Ammunition Grumman is also a leading provider when it comes to designing revolutionary advanced weapons that are smarter, more survivable, and effective to maximize combat capabilities for the demands of the future. Some of the innovative features of these weapons include smart munition, miniature munitions with the effects of a 500-pound bomb, advanced propulsion for unmatched ranges, and digital and weapon open systems architecture for unique combat configurations. Abby Sullivan, program manager of Grumman's Advanced Weapons, said, quote, What we do is critical. It's so important to be developing technology that's going to continue to make that warfighter safe out on the battlefield. As a result, Grumman is at the vanguard of development. In their words, quote, developing new advanced ammunition types that include armor penetration, air bursting, proximity fused, and guided munitions to enhance lethality and overmatch on the battlefield. Through close cooperation with the Army, Grumman developed a new tank munition combining the sheer power of four M1 Abrams tanks into a single round. After over a decade, Grumman finally unveiled the XM1147 Advanced Multipurpose, or AMP, round to make the Abrams main battle tank more lethal than ever before. A new shell. The XM1147 Advanced Multipurpose Round, or AMP Round, is a line-of-sight tank round developed by Northrop for the M1 Abrams tank, originally designed in the late 1970s during the imminent Soviet invasion during the Cold War. The purpose of the XM1147 is to do the job of four existing rounds currently employed by the main battle tank of the U.S. forces and consolidate the unique capabilities of each of them into a single munition. If successful, the XM1147 AMP will replace the four existing 120mm tank shells the M1 Abrams has used in combat for decades. The shells in question are the M830 High Explosive Anti-Tank, or Heat Round, and the M830A1 Multipurpose Anti-Tank, or MPAT, designed for attacking light armor and aerial targets. The other two are the M1028 Canister, or CAN Round, employed to impact infantry targets outside the range of machine guns and functions as a giant shotgun shell. The other round to be replaced is the M908 Obstacle Reducing Round, an explosive warhead that breaks up concrete dragon's teeth and anti-tank obstacles. The U.S. Army awarded two contracts for the AMP round development in 2015 in a competition between Orbital ATK, which is now part of Northrop Grumman, and General Dynamics. Testing was expected to occur in 2020, but was delayed due to COVID-19. Operational assessment was rescheduled for November and December 2021 for full rate production beginning in 2022 and 2023. 4-in-1 Tank Round 
The AMP round had three modes, including Point Detonate, or PD, Point Detonate Delay, or PDD, and Airburst to defeat different targets, including bunkers, obstacles, light armor, dismounted infantry, and ATGM, or anti-tank guided missile teams. With Point Detonation, the round explodes upon contact with the target, making it effective against armored vehicles. Point Detonation Delay does not explode immediately upon impact, as it is intended to penetrate bunkers and obstacles, and explode once it is penetrated deep enough to cause maximum damage. With Airburst Mode, the projectile explodes at a preset height above the ground, raining tungsten shrapnel on the area below. The XM-1147 can easily pulverize obstacles and concrete walls, and completely flatten bunkers before an infantry attack. The round is so powerful that it can tear apart buildings and armored vehicles. Such power and versatility come from a smart fusing system that performs differently according to the type of target to be engaged. Compared with existing 120mm rounds with a maximum reach of 500 meters for short-range use against infantry, the AMP can target groups of enemy personnel at ranges of up to 2,000 meters when used in airburst mode. In addition, the AMP is the first round to meet the HERO, or Hazard of Electromagnetic Radiation to Ordnance Standard, to withstand electromagnetic pulses that can damage or destroy electronics. Army Testing The Army began live fire testing in August 2020, including ammunition sensitivity testing to determine crew vulnerability to an onboard AMP energetic reaction and testing against bunkers and walls to evaluate performance against hard targets. Staff Sergeant Nicholas Smearman from the 4th Infantry Division was one of the lucky men to test the power of the round during a November 2021 test. In an Army release, he said, quote, It was incredible. To be out there, doing what we're doing, to be able to set forward the future of M1 Abrams' development, and the fact we were the first ones out there, probably will be the only ones who have hands on this round for a long time, to be able to set that historically, we felt honored to be out there. Staff Sergeant Smearman explained that the 4-in-1 tank round will make tactical planning in an operational environment much easier. He explained, quote, The term that we use is battle carry, what round we have in the breach when we enter combat. Usually that's going to be decided by what we expect the enemy to be throwing at us. If we're expecting tanks, we're going to battle carry Sabo, our tank defeating round. The AMP allows us to battle carry that round without fear of running into a different enemy. The AMP remains in development for the time being but the crews of all the armored regiments in the United States Army cannot wait for the round to be incorporated into the Army's arsenal and experiment with it firsthand. When asked if his men would feel comfortable employing the round under real combat operations, Smearman replied, quote, Yes, I would take it to hell and back. Thank you for watching our video. Please like and subscribe to our Dark Tech channel to discover more interesting videos about the latest that military technology has to offer. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to be notified of our newest videos.